What's going on, everybody? My name's Chris, and welcome back to the most exciting episode of Legion of Zelda. Even green after. Wait, what? <clears throat> Twilight Princess HD you've ever seen? Oh crap! I gotta adjust my mic a bit. Oh no! Oh, ooh! Wow! Okay, did that break anything? No. I'm sorry. That was really obnoxious. Well, that looks very ominous. Can I, are these like the sacred, sacred forests? The sacred forests? Whoa! What? <gasps> No way, the suit of armor is alive! Just kidding, it was the first one. Oh god. He looks he looks all weird goblin-y. He's like <laughs> Um, I don't really remember how to fight this guy very well, but I see hookshot targets. This is very forgettable in my opinion. Oh, okay, that was clearly not. Oh god! Oh shit. Oh, I see. I gotta. Wait, what? Oh, he has a tail, so he's not a goblin, asshole! Oh my god. Where am I good? How do I get him to shoot? I just gotta wait? Um. <laughs> Uh, what can I do? Oh boy, okay, I can't do that again. Uh, ooh, e. Oh my god, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna fucking die. God dang it. Holy crap, I got my butthole handed to me. That was really bad. I couldn't get out of there. I really wish this game didn't automatically take a freaking Ganondorf from me, but whenever I freaking died, so stupid. It's like why? I just I would this this is honestly about as annoying. Oh, it just starts me off here. Oh god! So in other words, one hit, I'm dead. Are you freaking kidding me? Shut the fuck up! Oh, it's just gone now. Well, that kind of wait a minute. What's this look like? That was, like a... that was weird. Okay. Right, gotcha. I wonder how I get him to throw his ball. Okay, that doesn't do a gosh dang thing. What if I, uh... No, I actually want that there. And that there. Alright, that doesn't do a gosh dang thing. What? <sighs> oh boy, so it's gonna be one of these episodes, isn't it? Oh boy, oh boy. It's always the mini bosses. Why is it always the mini bosses? Uh, you know what? I'm gonna have my red potion, I think. Let's do that. And I, I know I'm not in hero mode yet, but that's okay, because it doesn't affect the potions. We'll do that real quick, like. There we go. Um, because, once I go through this room, the the, the potion that um, the yetis make will actually give me eight hearts anyway, so it'll be the, it'll be the equivalent of a normal po a red potion, so it'll be all good in the hood. <laughs> it's interesting how it starts me on the far left there, too. Oh, God. <gasps> oh my god, dude, really? Like, like, come on! Oh my god, fuck my life. I just gotta, do I just have to wait? Like, how do I know when he's gonna throw the damn thing? Oh god. Call that good. I'm gonna call. Oh my! Like, come on! He's doing like the back slice. Well, I'm not. I'm just trying to get him to roll away. Oh my! Holy crap! Oh 
Oh my god. No, no, stop. Oh. For fuck's sakes! I'm getting needlessly angry. Okay, now I feel like I have to go back and get the damn potions. <sighs> it just, it's so bullshit the way- Ugh, this game! Put the- put the damn- oh my god, you put the damn on me. Please. Please! Oh no, wonderful. What a great way to start. Alright. Oh, I guess, yeah, I guess it's a short trip anyways, because I just gotta go through here, then through here. Lady, I hate you. I just want you to know I hate you. That was like the one shot I had doing this. Well, uh, I guess this, this, I'll probably get it after this one, to be honest. I just have to prepare properly. But, okay, um... I might be able to get it by just mashing... Oh, fuck. Yes, I know, I'm trying to see if I can mash the buttons, see if I can, uh, yeah, there we go. Now, now let's roll away, let's roll away, let's roll away, yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to avoid conversation. What if I walk up back then, that's when he tells me he needs more punch. Oh, no, Betty loves me. See if we can do it again. Oh dang it. There we go. <clears throat> Scoop scooby doop. Alright, now watch us do this boss fight without taking a single hit now. This mini boss fight. It is very, very, very nice having free health in this temple though. It's cool how you see like as time goes on. Or like th this is something you normally don't notice because it's like oh free health who cares this game's easy as hell anyways but not in hero mode and again or from evil mode it sure as heck is not it's nice though I really like it I really like the difficulty it is really frustrating <laughs> with some stuff like this put that there and pray I don't accidentally press the dang wrong button it's like that's the wrong number. I don't know if I'm far enough away. I don't know how to like... Wait. Okay. Woo! Alright, so it seems you just have to get far enough away. That's probably what gets in the pieces. Ball and chain. Oh no, no, no. Go, go away, go away, go away. See, if I really throw it again now? Because I'm so far away. I don't think so. I think he has to walk his fat ass over here. Right, let's try now. Oh boy. There we go. Oh god. It's so awkward. Like, his tail's hard to hit. No, no. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh boy. Oh boy. I think he should. Throw it at me at this point. Okay, I think if I jump, go to the middle. Yeah, I don't think he could hit me from there. Well, I guess he actually could. Ooh. Oh, fudge. Oh, God. Ah! Oh, no! Drink the damn soup, drink the damn soup. Drink the damn soup, drink the damn soup. Drink the damn soup, drink the damn soup. Are you fucking kidding me? Am I just stuck now? I'm just stuck in a damn loop. Okay, I know he threw it, that's great, but I need this. Oh, okay, we're just gonna... No! Oh my fucking, like... A little bit frustrating. Just a little, just a little baby bit. Okay. I think one more round should hopefully do it. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> he moves really funny. <laughs> Great. Cool. Wonderful. Actually, I wonder if that's better to... Ooh, I wonder if it's better to move that way instead of using the hookshot. Because when you use your hookshot... There we go. Wow, really? When you use your hookshot, it's almost like... Like you have a chance of going right in the ball's range, you know? Or just flying past it. It would be cool if there's like a Lizzo false in there or something. Whoa, the ball and chain was left behind. And wow. 
Good job trying to look badass when you very clearly had a really bad time with this link. It's all your fault, not mine. Never, never, ever, ever would I ever, could I ever blame myself for such a horrible, horrible thing. Alright. You got the ball, G! Which is strong considerably. Wow. This giant iron ball has incredible power. Uh, so, uh, so we need to cost serious damage. Damage! Cool, now let's get the boss king, get the balls out of here. Put the balls on the coconut and bring it all up. Oh no! Well, this sucks. This th we are in a pickle, you guys. There we go. So, boom, boom. I think I could actually just walk around with this. Yeah, there we go. Whoa, what was that? Was there a rat in there? I destroyed something. Yeah. So we can destroy all kinds of things now, which is actually pretty fun. Bone chain is at least much more useful than the spinner, but at the same time, it really doesn't have very much use in the overworld. Besides, like, yeah, the overworld that isn't in this temple, which is kind of unfortunate, but eh, you know, it is still it, it's certainly a fun item at least. Ooh, I was, I was scared those those pillars were gonna hurt me. There's actually some uh, good stuff in some of these um, iron shells. You got Ordon goat cheese. What? This goat cheese is made from milk from Ordon goats. Where the heck are these people getting these Ordon stuff, man? Oh, food again? Yeah, I had a bad feeling about this. She didn't seem very sure of herself. Oh well, let's head back home for some other brilliant idea. Brilliant. Brilliant! So, of course, not having the dungeon of the item. <laughs> See what I did there? I, um. Uh, it's completely. It makes traveling around the temple much, 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 much easier. Because now all these. Ice blocks blocking my way. Oh, wow, I just walked through a cannonball. Life is a cannonball. Destroy all the things. Oh boy, unleash all the wolves. Yeah. Oh god, I hate this part. Uh, jump up there. I like chipping away at this. Really? There you go. Looks like four hits or something. Oh god. Actually, we're, we're nowhere near death, but oh god. Please get, out. Please get out of here! Oh god, come on, Link. Come on. The hero of time does not have issues walking to and fro. Or something. I guess he apparently does, but. Alright, hello. What happened? Uh, what? Jeans? Uh, did husband move it? Uh, where in the world did we put it? Sorry, I need thinking time. Uh, take cheese the husband, huh? You could do that. I try to remember. <laughs> I need to make the soup. The game's way of telling me make the damn soup. I want to move my mic again. I'm sorry. Oh god, it's so awkward. It's so awkward. It's so noisy and awkward. Oh god, just my mic isn't really in a good spot. There we go. Cool. Readjust your mic completely. 13 minutes into the episode. That's that sounds like a great idea. Ah, needs more punch, huh? Ah. What good smell! What you have, huh? <laughs> I cut the cheese. <laughs> At least they didn't knock me off my perch. Mmm, perfect ingredient, huh? Little more time on fire, become gourmet soup. Here, taste, huh? Mmm, smells good. Uh, uh, wife feel better when she drink this. Is this? Do, do I actually need to wait a bit, or will this actually be good now? You got sapoob sapoob <laughs> soup in your blood. It smells quite cheesy. Eight hearts. Ah, oh, it's so great. Three red potions. Oh boy. Cool. So now we don't really need to worry about rupees in this game anymore. Because now we just have well, I guess we don't have a good way to get here though. So that's kind of unfortunate. Hey. This would be very nice for the boss though. The soup actually looks pretty good. <laughs> It's making me hungry. I actually made corn for the first time in my life today on my own. It's really, really quick to make, actually. I was very surprised. Like, how just... It was so easy. I've never even seen anyone make it. Like, I've had it before, obviously, but... I've never even really watched anyone make it before, so I just looked up online. All you gotta do is boil the water and then throw it in for, like... I put mine in for five minutes, so it took, it took like, what, 15 minutes to make in total? We put... We put key in no by room, so no forgetting, uh... How I forget? Embarrassing, uh... See? Here, place my mark my baby So there we go. Now we know. It there, it must be, uh, you look for me. Ah! 
Hallelujah, lady. Um, I want to go on top of that wall where we saw that freezer in the last episode, but uh, I like got the end of the episode. But I don't know if this leads to that. I guess it does. Uh, it does. I guess. There's another freezer here. It looks like. Hey, he's like in the middle. I think. Could he hit me? Probably. Actually. Yep. I don't know, he's an idiot freezer. He moves left and right and such. How far does he go? Not very. What the fool? I gotta hit these guys twice to kill them. And yep, kills those guys in one hit as well, which is nice. There's another one. And another one. Wow, it's like these guys have pet freezers. Isn't it great? How far down do you go, sir? I really don't want to taste your feezy freeze. A juicy freeze. Oh my god! Holy crap! Oh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, that definitely should have frozen me. That one. Okay, there we go. That's okay. Yeah! Kill all the noobs. All the noob scrubs. Can't do anything about those blocks yet. There's black noobs. Oh, there's the. Oh, oh there's a bat. Wait, was the other one a bat too? I think it was one of those ice guard things with the spears we had to fight before. Do we have a cannonball? I don't think we do yet. We're upstairs. I don't know where the compass in this dungeon is. Oh, I saw you. I saw you. Ooh, okay. Yeah, these guys are pretty freaking annoying, to be honest. However, uh, the head split. S splinter, split, splitter. This was very helpful. Oh, I feel like that's going to be the compass. Oh, it's a hookshot target. That's cool. Is that like a shortcut, I wonder now? Oh, oh, that's the ice block room, right? No? I guess not. Oh, right. I cannot remember how to do this. So, yeah, you can actually use this to create momentum, which is neat. They did lead over Rito! Whee! Whee! Kind of reminds me of the, the platforms you'd push with the leaf and, um... Ah, oh, that's not the compass. Oh... Really? Dang it. Kind of reminds me of the... the um, yeah, the, the platforms you push with the leaf in uh, Wind Waker. I don't know why, really. But it, she does. That she does. Oh boy. Let's have to go. Please reach. Yeah. Meh! <gasps> Holy crap! Compass actually might be down. Oh, you know what? I think the compass is, da is down there. Can we just jump down here? Surely we can, right? Let's just do it. Damn it! Wow. Well, that was a four hard risk I just failed at. We could just drop down right here, maybe. Uh, actually, right there is probably. A bit oh, come on! How many hearts do I have? Okay, I'm not dead. Fine, we'll just walk down there like a normal human being. Well, GG, another potion. Good God, that was stupid. Shouldn't have done that at all. Okay, so there's a cannonball there. Oh, I gotta go to that room anyways, don't I? Do I have a key. Oh, I do have a key. Oh crap. Oh, this leads to the first room. I think there's another Poe in here. Oh no, is this. Oh no, never mind. Yeah, it is the main room. Another hookshot target for a shortcut of purposes. Yeah, we actually are in the main room now. You know what? I'm gonna go back. Because I'm pretty sure I could actually. I'm pretty sure. I feel like the compass is actually down here. So let's go. Let's go unleash our compassing potentials. Whoa. Yeah, that was weird. Um, this way, right? Yes, this way. Do 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 do. Uh oh no, it's just a shortcut. Oh, we gotta bring a cannonball this way. Also, there's this asshole. Can we kill this ass guy? This asshole guy? I don't think we could reach, but let's let's try over time from like here. No, there's no way. Yeah. Oh god. Link, I would watch out if I were you. <laughs> Throwing that giant cannonball 
the iron ball chain thing. Probably not very, like if that landed on your head, that'd probably be very, uh, unfortunate. Oh God. No! Uh, yeah, toss a giant cannonball. I'm sure that would work well in real life. <laughs> Boom. And back we go. Back we go! Yeah, I thought this led to the room we were, we were trying to jump to a few minutes ago where I took like eight hearts of damage trying to jump to, but nope. I think we actually throw these cannonballs at the freezers and embrace them as well. Which is hilly billy areas. Alright, we have approached 20 minutes here, so I do gotta end the episode. Thank you all very much for watching. If you enjoy, the best way to support me is by leaving a like, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Let's end this episode off with a boom. Get it? Because I'm going to blow up this cannon. It'll be great. Oh, there's snowflake symbols on there. That's kind of cool, I guess. I don't know what this will actually accomplish. Um. Actually... Oh, that's cool. There's a straight up giant hole in that roof. I think I gotta move those blocks and then blow up the cannon if I remember correctly. How do we get to the room down below? No. Oh, do we get to our. Where's that map again? Map. There we go. Yeah. Like, yeah, I guess I was never there. Alright, in the next episode, we will maybe even finish off the dungeon. This dungeon is going by really quick. Well, 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 at least probably get to the boss. So, if you guys enjoyed the best way to support me is by leaving a like, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. The next one, we push through the dungeon and maybe complete it. I don't know. Actually, probably, well, maybe we'll see what happens.